Hi everyone, this is Teacher JM, and welcome to Science 3 Quarter 1 Week 4 of the revised K-12 curriculum with the topic, Objects That Are Shiny. By the end of this lesson, learners should be able to 1. Describe objects that are shiny. 2. Identify objects that are shiny. Can you think of some hard objects you use at home and at school? Where do you use them, and what do you use them for? For this day, you will be focusing on one characteristic of objects, shiny. You will be describing shiny objects. You will also determine whether an object is shiny or not. What is the meaning of shiny? Is an adjective that describes something that reflects light, often because it's clean, polished, or glossy. The antonyms of shiny is dull. Activity three. What shiny objects I see at home and at school. Materials needed per group. Flashlights, a coin, aluminum foil, a spoon, a wooden ruler, and bond paper. One. Draw two boxes on your notebooks and label them. Two. Pick one object from the given materials list. 3. Shine a flashlight on your object and observe if it becomes bright or not. Four. Observe your groupmates' objects as they light the flashlight on them. Five. In the shiny box, draw the objects that appear bright when exposed to light. Where can you find shiny objects? At home, school, everywhere. What makes you say that an object is shiny or not? When it sparkles, when it is bright. Shiny objects are those that become bright when light is shone on them. Which of the following do you think will become bright when shone with light? One, what are examples of shiny objects? Two, how can we say that an object is shiny? Three, what are the basic uses of shiny objects? True or false? Write T if the statement is true about shiny objects, and F if false. And, um, shiny objects can only be found outside the house and school. And, two, when shown with light, wooden popsicle stick will become bright. Three, shiny objects can also be hard or stretchable. Four, a ring is usually shiny. Five, shiny things can be big and small. Let's check your answer. 1. False. 2. False. 3. True. 4. True. 5. True. That's end our lesson in science. 3 quarter 1, week 4 of the revised K-12 curriculum with the topic, Objects that are shiny.
Thank you for watching. This is Teacher JM and don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell for more updates. You can also support our YouTube channel by clicking like button, sharing this video, and putting a comment for the content that you want us to cover. Again, thank you and see you next video.